Hey everybody, what's up and welcome back to today's video guys. And today guys, I'm going to go ahead and be showing you how to fix this error right here that you may be getting on WhatsApp if you cannot send or receive messages. So this is a common error that a lot of people get, so I'm going to go through the necessary steps that you need to take to get rid of this error and fix it. So yeah guys, make sure to watch this quick and easy video till the very end and follow my steps correctly so you can make sure this works the same for you and that you can do this yourself. But yeah guys let's get straight into it so guys the first thing you want to do is go ahead and open up whatsapp to see if you can receive or send messages as you can see currently i can but let's say that you see you cannot uh, receive messages or send them so here is a couple of solutions that you can try the first thing you want to do guys is to go ahead and check if you have internet connection so you have to make sure your wi-fi is on and you have stable internet connection or you are on your mobile data and you have internet so the first thing is that the second thing you have to do is to check that whatsapp isn't down so what you want to do is go ahead and search google and see if whatsapp is down just type is whatsapp down like this i'm going to type is whatsapp down uh is whatsapp down and here on the first side you'll see the down detector there where you can see if whatsapp is down and if it still isn't down then this the next thing that you have to do is to make sure the person hasn't blocked you so you have to make sure that the person hasn't blocked you so that you can see, see and receive message from them and guys if you have checked all of these options and still isn't working then guys the only thing left for you to do is to go ahead and uninstall whatsapp so go ahead and search uh, search the Google Play Store for WhatsApp and here you want to delete it after uninstalling it guys just go ahead and install the application again log into your account and confirm your account phone number and after that you'll be able to normally receive WhatsApp messages. So guys basically those are the solutions that you can try so I hope this video was helpful if it was make sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel so guys thank you for watching take care and bye.